we're going to take a deadly ultra assault rifle gun off the streets. This is a 12 gauge rifle right here and you can see it has the short barrel and the, uh, the barrel shroud attached to it, you know, which is also, you know, the shoulder thing that goes up. It makes it a lot more deadly. So with this being this short and whatnot, we're going to do, you know, hashtag not one more and destroy it today. So, you know, I have, uh, they told me when I went to the gun store and asked what tool they said would be best to destroy it with, they said a crowbar. So well, here we go. I think we need to step up the, I'm going to go get the splitting wall. Yeah. Um, so I decided to call the ATF field office, you know, because they're experts with firearms and they said I should try using a splitting mall to destroy it. So here we go. Do it maybe, again. Maybe the back end. We're getting there, folks. I can already feel the lives being saved. Hashtag not one more. Not one more. Whew. Oh, um, I, I see uh, the, the bullet, the bullet shooter is still inside it. So I think the bullet shooter is making it so that I can't um, uh, break the, break the, uh, the upper receiver as well. Um, but the, I'm not going to be deterred. We're going to keep hitting it until the bullet shooter inside the upper receiver breaks apart. That's still fixable. <laughs> oh yeah, ATF would be like, it could still be brought back to service. <laughs> Get the crowbar, it'll still work. <laughs> Man. Dang. Oh, that's pretty good. The top's yeah. broken off. Yeah. Give it a few more hits. Okay, now it's actually missing chunks. Well, folks, the, the bullet shooter is still, still um, causing people to get killed right now. So, but by destroying this, I'm going to make sure that you know, drug traffickers in downtown Portland won't be murdering people anymore because I destroyed my lawfully possessed firearm. That's how it works. <laughs> Dang, this stinks. Are we sure this isn't how they normally come from Turkey? <laughs> <laughs> Professionally oh. assembled? Like, what do you guys think of my, uh, what do you guys think of my, um, Rock Island, uh, 20 gauge? It's pretty sweet, isn't it? I hear it's made in the Philippines. <laughs> From an old cult factory. Yeah, totally. Ooh, there you go. <laughs> oh, you didn't torch it. it you didn't torch cut it. It could still be brought back to service. There we go. <laughs> it still looks like a pistol to me. But at least it's not a short-barreled rifle. No. Well, folks, you know, I think it I think it won't work anymore. The the bullet shooter doesn't have the the upper receiver to send the uh, the 20 gauge bullet through the barrel shroud anymore. So we've now saved at least 10 bajillion lives.
Hashtag not one more.